Kirinyaga Governor Anwe Guru has given hip-hop artist King Kaka 48 hours to remove his new song Wajinga Nini from all social media platforms and issue a written apology to her over his recent remarks in the new song. Ati Waiguru wako kwa office na story ya NYS tulisha sao bairo moja li by eight tau. Will King Kaka apologize? My name is Lynn Gugi. Let's get started. Now, Ann Waiguru is demanding King Kaka to apologize to her over the remarks he made in his new song. Waiguru made these demands through her lawyers, Kiragu Waduta and company advocates, and has also ordered Kaka not to release any further defamatory songs about her. According to Waiguru, the remarks about her in the song are highly defamatory, depicts her as corrupt and insinuates she was engaged in theft of public funds, something she denies. At Waiguru wako kwa office na story ya NYS tulisha sao bairo moja li by eight tau in the demand letter, her lawyers say you ought to have known that despite extensive investigations and several prosecutions in relation to the loss of funds at NYS, our client has never been charged in a court of law as an accused person in relation to NYS or any other scandal. Up to this moment, King Kaka has not apologized and as always, Kenyans took to Twitter to weigh in on this debate and this is what some had to say about it. Miguna Miguna said after Waiguru was appointed a CS from a low-level contract position at Treasury, she moved her children to Brookside and UK private schools. She bought a shilling, uh, she bought a four million uh, house in Kitusuru in cash and started a business for her high school son. Bravin says Anne Waiguru made a mistake going after King Kaka for whatever reasons she thought. Her lawyers are ill advised. You can't sue a piece of art and win in court. A piece of art is subject to interpretation. It's not a journalism piece. Plus, King Kaka calling Waiguru or thinking she's corrupt is not a crime. In his song, King Kaka says Waiguru ako ofe and not an Waiguru ako ofe. We all understand Wanjiku is a Kikuyu word, which means the people people or citizens and Waiganjo means fake. Waiguru on the other hand means a corrupt person or corruption. Ah, you to watch here, Apple. Uh, Simon Washuri says, in the case of one King Kaka versus one Ann Mumbi Waiguru Waiganjo, it's clear King Kaka will win. If he fails to delete the content and wait for a an arrest warrant, Kenyans will all back up King Kaka, then BBI will have to wait until King Kaka is proven innocent. Well, other people had mixed reactions about this and they urged Waiguru to go ahead and sue King Kaka. This is what Martin Kaumbudu Jr. had to say about it. Go ahead, Your Excellency. Teach them a lesson. Waiting for those sponsors to defend him in court. We know you are clean and this guy was paid to tarnish your name in public. They are all over fighting governors who differ with them. Jagi Gashigi said, King Kaka deserves a lesson he won't forget anytime soon. Defamation is a serious offense and punishable by law. Sami Washiras told Waiguru, you withdrew defamation charges against Raila in the spirit of handshake. Why are you now purporting to sue King Kaka on similar charges? Is the handshake a preserve? Well, guys, I would love to hear what you have to say about this. Either sis in the Wajinga, Amakona marking scheme ya cow. Time will tell. Waiguru has also in the past sued people who have related her to the NYS scandal. In August 2018, she threatened to sue Ipsos for naming her amongst the most corrupt people in Kenya. In May 2017, she, su she sued DCI, Attorney General and EACC for suggesting that a lifestyle, a lifestyle audit be carried out on her over her involvement in NYS scandal. Uh, in January 2016, she sued Mudama for suggesting she was having a clandestine affair with President Uhuru. And finally, in September 2015, she sued Raila for linking her to the NYS scandal. So guys, I would love to hear your views on this. Do you think King Kaka should remove the song from all his social media platforms and apologize? Huh? Apologize. <laughs> hey. Say what now? And apologize to Anne and apologize to Anne Waiguru. Let us know has this song defamed Anne Waiguru in any way? 
I would love to hear your thoughts on this. And also, if King Kaka is watching, we would also love to know what his response to this would be. My name is Lynn Gogi. Thank you for watching. You can apologize. Ah! <laughs>